Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Ultra Hardware 44870 Zinc Patio Door Lock. This is a um, sliding patio door lock, is what it is. Um, you've got your interior trim locked and unlocked and it just moves the mechanism on the inside okay which communicates to the strike that will be appropriately located you've got your exterior trim in this model the 44 870 includes a key cylinder it turns that tailpiece there okay and that communicates to the back side here. There's a bird's mouth cut inside of the moving cam, or, well, a triangle, you can see. So it communicates there, and as you rotate the, the tailpiece for the cam, it makes that travel, obviously, is how that works. There are um, variations on this, and I'm going to pull that up next. Uh, also, uh, Ultra has this dimensionally. I'm going to go over the dimensions in a moment. Okay. All right, Ultra Hardware, here we go. Pulling up the catalog. While that's loading, let's go over the dimensions. What we've got is, we've got it at seven and a quarter long and seven eighths wide with six and five eighths hole centers. Let's check it out. Seven and a quarter. That is indeed the case. Let's get the tail, let's get the locking bar out of the way. Okay, seven and a quarter, yep. 7 eighths wide, mm, closer to 1 inch, uh, 6 and 5 eighths center on the screws, yep I'd say that'd be correct as well, <clears throat> you're going to get that strike plate here as well, about 2 and 5 eighths overall height, a width, 3 quarter inch, maybe 11 sixteenths, total projection, about, seven, about 15 sixteenths. Now, let's talk about the variations uh, on this unit, 4870. Okay, so this part of the video is going to tell you how these things change. First of all, the 44870 is a no-latch version, meaning that you have to manually relock it. That's what, the, that's what that means. The 44873 is identical except that there's no trim on the outside. There's no way to get in. On the 44873, all you can do is lock it and unlock it from the inside. You can get into the models that have a, a night latch feature, okay, where they will lock um, as you close them. You've got your 44, the, the night latch version of this equal to it is the 44881, key lock and in chrome. The 44871 is no key lock and in chrome. And then there's even black, which is a 44878 with a key plug in, in a black finish. You can also <clears throat> purchase replacement cylinders for these. And you've got. Um, 55840 and 55, uh, pardon me, 58420. 58420 and 58422 are the two cylinders. We've got a one inch and an inch and eighth overall diameter on those. You can remove the cylinder. You, you'll hardly be able to see it, but at the tip of my, f at the tip of my finger is a spring-loaded uh, clip. If I were to get in there and depress it, I could remove the entire core 
should you need to do that, it's nice that they make that available. But also, in addition to the locks themselves, they have a variety of door pulls that are also available, uh, etc. So Ultra Hardware is a uh, rather comprehensive importer of many things builders hardware related. Sliding door locks is just part and parcel of what it is they sell. Lots of hinges, a lot of trim and auxiliary hardware, and uh, even some commercial grade material as well, lock sets and exit divisors. If you have any questions on the Ultra Hardware, part number 44870, sliding door lock, or any other Ultra Hardware product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.